I got a little bit of damage on the right front there. Oh, we're actually going to be on a real road? What? Wh what is this? How are you supposed to do that in a truck? Uh-oh. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh! Ooh. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Beam NG Drive. It has been a long time since we last played this game. Probably has been over half a year, if not more. Maybe a full year, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, but this is a game that a lot of you guys wanted me to jump back into. I get a lot of requests on my Brick Rigs episodes to, hey, you should play some more Beam NG Drive. So we're going to do that here today and start this back up. Now I have another... I would say a couple other games that I have in mind that are going to start back up on the channel and some new stuff here very soon. But we're going to go ahead and start off with this and see kind of what's changed. Uh, now, normally when I play BeamNG Drive, I do a lot of the scenarios as far as I like the race scenarios or I like the chase uh, type scenarios. I do crashes sometimes, but that hasn't always been my thing. I'm not opposed to setting up some crashes, so if you guys have any suggestions for that, Comment below. Let me know what you guys want to see out of this series once again. Uh, but today, we're probably going to start this off, I would say, a little bit slower. But it's still going to probably be pretty intense. So, I've been eyeing this ETK truck rally race. You've got this Utah map and you've got three stages here. And I believe this is like a rally raid truck, which we've done some of this in Brick Rig. So, I'm kind of excited to see... Uh, a little bit of the comparisons, I know one's Lego, and one is like this full-on physics, soft body, awesome game. So, uh, we're gonna start off with this here. Uh, what is this rated? Okay, it is rated hard. Um, I guess we're ready for that. But anyways, we're gonna jump right into this and check out this scenario. Alright, so we're ready to go here. We are at the ETK Truck Rally Race. This is Utah Stage 1. We're gonna try to get through all three stages here today. Uh, we'll see how tough they get. But yeah, uh, let's go ahead. We're going to jump right into this now. I am playing with an Xbox One remote because I'm a little bit more accurate with it opposed to the keyboard. Uh, but I think we can actually tackle this. Now, one thing I do remember about Beam and G is the checkpoint system's a little finicky. You pretty much have to hit it right in the middle. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Thought we were going to immediately destroy our vehicle there. All right, so we got to take a right. We're going to hit this checkpoint here. And then what in the heck? Why would you go straight off a cliff with a race vehicle? All right. There we go. Oh. <laughs> that hurt my spine. Ow. All right. Well, that went about as well as I could imagine. Uh, actually, you know what? We're going to be back on our uh, all four here. Hey. Look at... Actually, the... Oh, this looks like a boomerang. Okay, this is not going to work. Nope. Yep. It's Something's definitely broken here. All right. Let's go ahead and reset there and try that again. Now that I know there's a big cliff in the way... All right, here we go. Once again, we are lined back up. Let's try not to flip this time going down the cliff and bow out the vehicle. So, here we go. We're going to go ahead. We're let off a little bit here at this first jump because the back end typically wants to snap over. There we go. And we're going to swing wide here this time because I think we need a straight shot off this cliff. And there we go. Beautiful. All right, let's go down this. No, <laughs> don't do that. Oh, I thought going faster would actually be uh, better, and oh, oh, hold on, hold on, nope, yep, we have screwed this up, okay, alright, that's gonna, that's gonna definitely be a reset there, alright, here we go, once again, let's try not to screw this up, uh, this is only the first stage, I really hope the other stages don't get harder than this, cause, uh, I might be in some serious trouble here, all right, there we go. Over the first one. I think the, uh, you know, I want to say you want to go off faster on the cliff there, but maybe you don't. You just don't want it to be like, or you don't want it to be really slow and get stuck on the cliff. So maybe, oh yeah, that was a good speed. All right, we got some rocks here. We got to clear. Let's go ahead and go around those. Are you kidding me? Still popped my tire. Okay, well, we're going on a flat tire here, uh, no matter what. So there we go. All right, it's good speed, good speed. Feels good. I mean, it doesn't feel good anymore because the uh, right front's down, but we'll see if this thing can still uh, boogie down the straightaways here. Oh, yeah. Oh, this might be bad. Oh, this is bad. Okay, gotta watch these trees. I don't, you never know which tree is actually like an object that you can't go through, so... Uh, there we go. Oh, shot! Oh, wow, we really did shoot the gap there. Alright, here we go. Gonna speed along. That is really pulling me to the right 
Uh, oh, that's a couple big rocks that we don't want to hit. All right, let's go to the left here. Don't flip, don't flip. Okay, get back up. <gasps> that was a save. That was an awesome save. Okay, here we go. Two more checkpoints. Uh, off another cliff here. Don't, don't, don't you do this to me. Don't you do this to me. Are you kidding me? Really? Oh, come on. It's got to be able to flip itself back over here. Uh, let's work against the tree. And we are wedged in a tree. Are you kidding me? That was right before the finish line. That's ridiculous. All right. We've got another run coming up here. Uh, hopefully we can uh, successfully do this run and not get stuck right before the uh, the finish there because that, that's heartbreaking. Uh, here we go. Oh, 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 that didn't sound good. Uh, might have shattered a window, but eh, we're, we're okay. We're okay. All right, let's go ahead and turn here. Uh, that wasn't as smooth as I wanted it to be. All right, let's go around these rocks. It's so convenient they stick those rocks right there when you land. Uh, to blow your tires out. So let's try to avoid all of these. It's going to get a little rough here. And then we got some uh, wide open areas right up here. Here we go. All right, let's just try to get into the gas. Uh, we got to watch that final drop before the last checkpoint is really, really tricky. So we don't want to screw that up. Oh, it's bouncing so much. All right, this is like the best part right here because you want to shoot the gap between these two cliffs. Oh, look at the speed we're carrying. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> No, don't do this to me. No, not again. Not again. Okay, here we go. Hey, we're good. We're good. We're going to suffer time-wise, but, you know, maybe we made it up there with the speed that we were carrying. Man, if you could just hit that section perfectly and just go over the over the little jump they have there, that would be so awesome. All right, so avoid the trees here. We got one last drop. We're actually going to slow down a bit for this drop because I think that's what flipped us over last time. Uh, is going over it. Oh, come on. This thing does not steer good anymore. All right, here we go. All right, avoid the last tree, please. There we go. Ah, that time. See, that's the uh, the competitive nature in me. Doesn't enjoy, like, slowing down and flipping over like that. Uh, but, yeah. Anyways, well, I mean, we got a good rating. So, I mean, there's that. I still feel like we probably could have shaved off another seven seconds there, but... Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and jump over to the uh, stage two here. All right, ready to rock here on stage two. <laughs> oh, that almost sounds like a bad pun. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Anyways, this actually looks like a road. So, oh, and immediately we're going to go off here. All right, watch the trees. Watch the trees. Going to hit the water there. All right, so we have zigzagged. We're not going to use the perfectly fine road that's on the right side of the river. Uh, we're going to go off-roading here. And actually, here's another road. All right, not so bad, not so bad. I, I do see some rocks here in the, uh, oh, yeah, there's a lot of rocks up here in trees, okay. You have to be very, very careful. This almost seems like a little bit of luck, too, depending on where you land, uh, because there's trees everywhere. See, we had to skim through that one. All right, not bad. All right, we're gonna cross the river once again. Oh, come on, cut, there we go. Uh, let's cut around here, avoid this bush. Ah, uh, not too bad, we're already halfway through. This has been a uh, fairly clean run so far. All right. Oh, there is rocks on either side of the road. It would be nice to have like a co-pilot here. All right, maybe to kind of talk me through the course like a real rally stage. Uh, here we go. All right, so we're going to go down this. We're following along the river. This does remind me a lot of the uh, the canyon map on Brick Rigs for some reason. I guess it's the river and just the whole setting. But it actually does look quite similar. All right. This actually might be a clean stage. Uh, this might be a first. And I'm going to jinx myself here. Just you watch. All right, one more to get to. Oh, no. Oh, buddy. Okay, we lost a wheel. Come on. Uh, did we lose drive? Okay, we still have drive. You know, I think time-wise, this is still pretty good since we were so clean through the stage. We'll see what it gives us here. Yeah, I always jinx myself. I, I never understand that. That is ridiculous. Success. Okay, what did we get there? Is that the same time we ran the first stage? Kind of looks like it. That was clean. Uh, that stage didn't have too many tricks besides all the scattered trees and rocks. Uh, so that actually wasn't too bad. Uh, let's uh, go ahead and move on to the next one here. All right, we are ready to go here at stage three. This has got to be the, the tough stage because this looks, you can see where it ends. I think you can actually do this in a full, just one stage. I think I saw the scenario for that, but I can already see we're going to take a hard left up here and go up the hill. So. Uh, this is gonna be something. Let's hope this thing can cut here. 
Uh, let's go ahead and start to swing. We're gonna swing. Oh, there's rocks on both sides. Oh! Oh, this is gonna be so slow. All right, come on. There we go. Power up. Power up. Down, back down in the first, second. Here we go. Right, I'm looking for some high speed sections. I want to see this thing actually jump. We might go into some free roam and launch this thing off a canyon here in a second. Uh, if we don't get any awesome jumps up here. Oh! Oh, oh no, those are rocks. Those are all rocks. Are you kidding me? How are you supposed to avoid those? Oh, we've already missed the checkpoint. That's bad. Yeah, this thing's broken though. You can see the, uh, the left front's completely down and it's actually up in the wheel well really bad. So let's reset. I don't see a way to avoid those. Not unless you're just supposed to jump over them. Uh, kind of seems like a, a cheap tactic there. Gassed up, ready to go here. Stage three. Did I leave a little oil trail there? <laughs> it kind of looked like I left something dark on the uh, on the road there. Up, oh, up. Oh, come on, come on. That's like the toughest part right there. I mean, that would be awesome if we had like a little rally car to swing around, maybe handbrake a little bit. Uh, but no, we have a tank, so obviously we can't do that. You know, I haven't tried the handbrake in this. I don't even know if it's a thing. It probably is not. It probably just locks everything down and. Shoots forward. Alright, here we go. Over the rocks. Wow, are you kidding me? You're really supposed to launch over those. Are we good? I got a little bit of damage on the right front there. Oh, we're actually going to be on a real road? What? Wh what is this? How are you supposed to do that in a truck? Uh-oh. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh! Ooh. Oh, was that right on the driver? Oh, hold on. Uh, now nah, he's probably still fine here. He's kind of got the uh, the roof squinched in on his head how are you supposed to do that that is a uh, that's quite ridiculous all right uh, I guess we're gonna have to reset again there all right we are gonna get a smooth run in here that uh that cliff checkpoint kind of just threw me off like I was just confused looking at it. I was like where does it want me to go again it's like you really wanted me to take this uh huge truck up the side of a cliff like that and barely hang on uh, it seems kind of strange anyways let's go ahead and pick up some speed here now you really need to hit this next checkpoint fairly fast to clear the rocks, but there's some rocks on the other side of it, which is a bit of a pain, but there we go. We can hit the checkpoint, hit the checkpoint. Oh, oh, are we okay? Come on, fire it back up, fire it back up. We're good. Hey, I don't think we lost too much time there. The driver uh, might be a little bit uh, dead. I don't know. I can't see how far that roof caved in and how in the heck? Okay, I think I figured out how to do that. We just gotta go kind of slow and over the right side. I was too distracted by the whole fact the driver looks like he's probably in pain. Oh, you know what? The roof isn't too bad. Uh, fuel tank's ruptured. Hey, at least we haven't exploded yet. That's a thing. Alright, here we go. Over the rocks. There we go. Cleared those. Watch the rock on the right. Alright, up this stupid cliff. Okay, gotta stay to the right of it. I'm gonna take our time a little bit here. I don't want to try to bomb it. Like I, I mean, I really just want to gas up over it and get clear, but I know that's not a thing. So, okay, gas, clear the guardrail. Cool. I don't think we lost too much time there. So we're gonna go up this hill. Oh, don't have me go straight up a cliff here. All right, here we go. Gas up those. And oh crud! How am I supposed to do this? How are you supposed to do this? Fuel tank's ruptured, and it's on fire, and it just flew away. Okay. No, don't. Don't do that to me. No, okay, there's got to be a way to get back over here. All right. <gasps> oh, this might be a save. No, this is not going to be a save. Okay. We have a fuel tank on fire. Can we flip back over? Dang, we're losing so much time right here. All right. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> fuel tank is just on fire over there. How are you supposed to get up this? Uh, let's go ahead and just place some tires up here. Yeah, you have to use momentum to get up this thing, I think. And also we can wedge ourselves right there. Come on. Oh, it just tips itself over. That's so painful. We're so close. We're so close, game. Why? Why Why do you do this to me? Oh, I'm so let down at the moment. Okay. Yeah, I mean, the time's already screwed. I I'm not happy with that. Let's go ahead and reset. All right, here we come up to the cliff. Now, I figured out if you go slower, this actually works out a lot better. I mean, sure, you could probably bomb this thing and just hope you land on all wheels over the top of it. But if you kind of slow down a bit, uh, this actually works out. You want to stay right on this part of the cliff. And we just lost a fuel tank, and that one just caught on fire. 
Uh, I'm assuming we don't need those. I think we have a couple more. All right, it's good. It's good, I think. All right, we're gonna go up this hill here. The next little dip or hill is really a tire killer. So we're gonna take it nice and slow over this. And then we come up to this. Whatever this is, I don't understand how to get up this too much. So we're gonna just kind of take our time here. Try to hop up. Oh, is it gonna, are we gonna get it? No, don't flip, don't flip, don't flip. Oh, don't catch on fire either. All right, we are down to like zero fuel tanks, I believe. Oh crud, we're gonna miss this one. All right, oh boy. We might make it, folks. It's gonna be uh, maybe a lackluster time, but I'm probably gonna take it because that is a ridiculous area. Here we go to the top of the cliff here. Hit the gas. Clean time, and we're gonna launch off it. Oh boy, ouch. Oh, that hurt. What was that worth? Ah, you know, I, I don't know if that's just a completion badge or if there actually is a uh, first, second, and third place time there. But I will take that. That was actually kind of a pain in the rear end. Uh, so let's go ahead and shoot out to free roam real quick. And uh, we're going to do one more thing. We're going to launch this thing off a cliff and just try to see what it actually looks like when you destroy it. Uh, let's see. Uh, we need to go find something so we can uh, wrap up this episode. All right, we're going to be picking up some speed here. But yeah, folks, uh, let me know what you want to see out of this series. If you want to see more scenarios, if you want to see some free roam, some crash setups, police chases, uh, the possibilities are pretty well endless when it comes to Beam NG. So uh, I do want to thank you guys for all the love and support, all the people who wanted to see the series back. Glad to bring it back to you guys. Uh, like I said, we will be returning with some more pretty awesome stuff uh, coming up soon. Got some more Brick Rigs planned, Scrap Mechanic, a couple... I will say older series, and then I do have a new series that's going to be coming up very soon on the channel. Uh, we're going to launch off this cliff right over here. Actually, no, we're going to back up, and eh, we can get a little bit of speed here. I would say I'd bomb it from the road, but I don't think I'm going to clear that first one there. So, All right, here we go. We're ready to launch off the cliff. One last time, say goodbye to the truck. This truck has caused me some pain here today. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I could have done that in slow-mo, but I kind of wanted to see the satisfying crunch of real time there. But yeah, folks, uh, let me know if you want to see more of this. Maybe smash that like button, and we will see you guys next time on Beam NG. Thank you.